Dan the Waterproofing Man here. Today I'm going to be teaching you about something called a lintel. What a lintel is, is a bent piece of steel that goes above a window to support the bricks that go across the window. The problem with these things is they're made out of metal, made out of steel, so they rust. And when, the, when it rusts, it expands uh, the size of it a little bit and then it expands this side a little bit. So what happens is if the brick's in here, it presses a brick either up or out or a combination of both. Now when that happens, that breaks the mortar joint above your windows and then when you get wind-driven rain against the wall, it then comes inside through the mortar joints. Now, when that happens, it rots out the wooden frame around your window, and that's why a lot of the times it'll be, uh, water will be coming in the inside of your windows and you don't know where it's coming from. That's because the lintel's rusted out and it's pressed the bricks out or up, broken the seam and the mortar, the water's coming inside now. What it does is it, rot, it also rots out the wood around the window, and then you have to pull your window out, you have to completely change all the wood, put the new window back in, and it's very costly. I'm going to teach you today how to use Tough Skin Clear, coat this lintel that it will never rust on you. So in this photo you can see that the lentil has rusted and then pushed the bricks up and out, creating this long crack that runs along to the right side of this building. So in this photo you can see a typical crack from a rusted lentil. It actually goes out, zigzags up a few bricks, and then keeps running to the left. So here's another one where the lentil is rusted, but the cracks has gone vertically up and you can see it run right up to the top of the house here. So here is a very close-up view of a rusted lentil and how much it can lift bricks apart. There's quite a gap between that mortar and the bricks. So in this photo you can see that the lintel is completely rusted out and the crack is now running vertically down the side of the window. Here's another picture of a typical rusted lintel and what it can do to the side of a brick wall. So in this picture you can see a rusted lintel. So it has heaved the bricks out and the bricklayer has come back to repair that area, taken all the bricks out, now you expose the rusted lintel. They will have to take that lintel out, put a new one in, and then new bricks in, which is very costly and completely avoidable by coating that lintel in tough skin, clear rubber skin. So here we have two steel lintels. We want to use paper towel and make sure that these are dust free and also it's raining outside. So we want to make sure that these lintels do not have any water on them. The reason being is that Tough Skin Clear rubber skin is hydrophobic, which means water doesn't like it and it doesn't like water. They bounce off of each other. So once it's dry and you apply the Tough Skin Clear, water will now just bounce right off of this lintel and never get down to the metal to oxidize oxidize it, which is rust. All right, so let's take a look at how we apply Tough Skin Clear to these two lintels. So here we have our two lintels, and today we're going to be applying Tough Skin Clear rubber skin to the lintels. So you can use a brush or you can use a roller. It doesn't matter. Rollers go a little faster, but a brush does a good job too. So you want to dip it in the bucket and you'll notice that Tough Skin Clear is a lot like honey. And we made the viscosity like honey because honey fills in honeycombs. Over millions of years, bees have figured out the perfect viscosity to fill into holes and crevices. And that's what this liquid actually does. So you put it on bricks, it fills in the, bri the holes and crevasses in the bricks and in the mortar. Same with concrete block, concrete, concrete foundations, stucco and metal. Anything you want to put it on it, it will waterproof. So you do one layer on each of these lentils and then you let it sit. So you take a break. You can even talk to the contractors on site. They always have a good story to tell. Take a break, come back, you flip it over and do another coat on all sides. Two coats, the lentil's ready to go and it will never rust out on you. All right, so let's take a look at these lentils. As you can see, totally shiny, completely coated in Tough Skin Clear all the way along. So what we did is we coated both sides once, waited an hour, 
came back and coated both sides yet again. Now, you'll notice it's shiny. Tough Skin Clear is shiny. We put the shine in. The reason being is that when you have the shine, if you can see it, the light's not very good today. As you can see, it's pouring rain inside this new construction building without a roof on it. But when you have shine in the product, you can see every inch that the coating is on. So there's no parts that are missing coating. If you didn't have a shine, you couldn't turn it into the light and see that every square inch is absolutely covered. Now here's another thing. Sometimes when you're coating these things and you're doing it really thick, you can get, let me see if I can get this, there it is, a streamers of Tough Skin Clear that come down. They'll go down a few inches and then they'll stop as they're curing. Now don't worry about this. You just cut them off. The next day they'll harden and then you just cut them off before you use a lentil. All right, so that's a completely coated lintel that will never rust out. So there you have it. That's how you waterproof lintels to go above windows to hold bricks along the top of the window. If you don't do this, then these lintels will rust, they will pop the bricks forward and up, and they will create a space where water come in, can come in above the windows and rot the wooden casings out around your windows. Then you're into window replacement and casing replacement. Do this, that will never happen. Now, if you spill Tough Skin Clear on anything, like say you're using Tough Skin and clear rubber around uh, bricks around your windows to waterproof them and you spill it on your windows. You want to buy Max Muscle Mess Remover. It's made by us and it's the only thing that can take off the incredible adhesive power of Tough Skin Clear. So this is sold, Max Muscle is sold at any store that sells Tough Skin Clear. So you want to buy a bottle of this if you're buying this for cleanup. All right, so come back on our next videos to learn how to waterproof. Buy Tough Skin Clear and you can waterproof anything.